Hello, my name is Dr. Neil Baum. I'm a urologist in New Orleans, Louisiana, and I would like to take a few moments to talk with you about the relationship of testosterone and heart disease. In this seven minute video, I will talk with you about how the body achieves homeostasis or stays in the normal range, the problem of testosterone deficiency, I'm going to talk to you about several studies that were reported in 2014 that implicated testosterone as causing heart disease, but I will give you my opinion of those studies and my opinion regarding hormone replacement therapy and its safety even in men who have heart disease. The body attempts to achieve homeostasis and the body is always trying to stay within the normal range. If something is too high, we lower it. If something is too low, we raise it. For example, if we take in too much water, we will sweat and increase our urine output. If on the other hand, we have too little water in our body, the kidneys will help to retain water to try to achieve homeostasis. Someone has a problem of diabetes and high blood sugar, we attempt to lower the blood sugar. If they have high blood pressure, we try to give them medication or suggestions to get their blood pressure within the normal range. If someone has a low blood count or anemia, we attempt to raise the blood count to the normal range. Someone has a vitamin D deficiency, we try to increase the vitamin D in order to achieve homeostasis. Testosterone deficiency is very similar to those other conditions that I talked about. Testosterone is a hormone that is produced in the testicle and it is responsible for a male's sex drive. It is responsible for the muscle mass, his absolute energy, his bone strength, a man's mood, and it may, when it is decreased, cause a problem of depression. The normal range of testosterone is from 300 to 1,000. And the treatment of hormone replacement therapy is aimed at treating the symptoms of decreased testosterone. In the United States, 13 million men suffer from low testosterone. Most men who receive hormone replacement therapy report significant improvement in their symptoms associated with libido, energy, muscle mass, weight loss, etc. There are several conflicting reports regarding testosterone and heart disease. Several of these reports suggest that low testosterone increases the risk of heart disease. However, treating the deficiency really may actually protect against heart disease if a man has a low testosterone. A recent study comp compared men uh, following heart attacks after hormone replacement therapy. They looked at the number of men who had a heart attack 90 days after they were merely given a prescription of testosterone. The study reported that men with pre-existing heart disease had a risk of a heart attack following the mere writing of a prescription for testosterone. So what's the fault of the study? First of all, there was no follow-up whether the men on hormone replacement therapy re uh, achieved a therapeutic range of testosterone. There was no documentation that the blood levels of testosterone uh, were tested after a prescription was given. There was even no report if the men stayed on the treatment. And there was no documentation that the guidelines provided by the Endocrine Society were followed. A second study from the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology 
took male veterans greater than 40 years of age and were placed on testosterone replacement therapy and they reported a lower rate of death than those not receiving hormone replacement therapy. It makes sense since low testosterone is associated with a condition called the metabolic syndrome, which has an increased risk of heart disease, stroke, and death. Finally, a third study from the Journal of Sexual uh, Medicine showed that low levels of testosterone increases the risk of adverse cardiovascular events. High levels of testosterone were associated with a decreased mortality due to all causes, including cardiovascular disease. Testosterone replacement therapy is relatively safe in terms of cardiovascular health. Testosterone replacement therapy leads to significant changes in reduction in blood pressure, control of the blood sugar levels in men with diabetes, and all lipid levels, including a decrease in cholesterol levels. So what's the bottom line? low testosterone actually increases the risk of heart disease. Most studies demonstrated that hormone replacement therapy has no effect on cardiovascular risk factors and heart disease. So my advice is that men with a history of heart disease should have a discussion with their doctor about the use of hormone replacement therapy with testosterone. Thank you.